on 25th December 1914. It was only five months into the First World War. But the Germans, the French, and the British were sick and tired of killing each other senselessly. They looked around and all they could see were thousands and thousands of dead bodies. Their brothers and sisters, their friends and loved ones, dead. So the Germans put up Christmas trees in the trenches with signs on them saying, Merry Christmas, you no shoot, we no shoot. When all the troops on the other side saw these signs, they were surprised and relieved at the same time. They said to themselves, even though we've been fighting each other for a couple of months now, we've been killing each other and we are all enemies. But we are all humans. We all bleed the same. We all have loved ones back home, hoping and praying earnestly that we come back in one piece. So even though it was considered treason, they all abandoned their camps and gathered on a no man's land breaking bread and making merry, playing soccer, singing Christmas carols, and sharing pictures of their loved ones. This day, they learned to put all their differences aside and come together as one. And this day is remembered in history as the Christmas truce of 1914. As we celebrate Christmas, my advice to you is that this life is too short to be fighting against each other. This life is too short to be holding grudges. So let's learn from these soldiers. Let's put down all our differences. Let's put down all the bitterness. Let's put down all the anger and unforgiveness and come together as one. We might have a lot of differences. I might be a Christian and you a Muslim. I might be black and you are white. I might be African, but you are American or Asian. But all of that don't matter. Deep down within, we're all the same. So let's come together as brothers and sisters, because that's what we are. So if someone has wronged you, I want you to learn to forgive and forget. You can confront a person and try to solve it amicably. And for all you know, that person has no clue what he or she has done to you. And you are dead, palpitating, giving yourself a headache, on the verge of having a heart attack, and that person is somewhere enjoying their lives. Christmas is a day of celebration. It's a day of joy. It's a day of happiness. It's a day of celebrating the gift of God to us. So let's stop pulling each other down. And let's try to push each other up. Let's stop competing with each other and try to complete each other. Because together we stand and divided we fall. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.